that's me, that's a nanoneedling device, and that's my face. And if that's not strange enough for you, take a look at this. It actually might be good for your health. Is Greek food more your speed? We have you covered. Plus, Morgan has a lot in store to help you start your year off right. That's all today on SoFlow Health. Hello and welcome to SoFlow Health. I'm Hunter Frankie and Happy New Year. We hope you had a happy and healthy holiday, but it's time for new year, new you, and some new skin. Well, at least exfoliating off last year's old skin and exposing some fresh new skin. That's why we're here at Skin Miami. And let's go inside and meet Caleb to find out what we're doing today. As promised, this is Caleb of Skin. Caleb, what is skin? We are a results-oriented med spa. Uh, our goal is to give you undetectable enhancements to your natural beauty. That's great, I'm excited. And what are we doing today? Today we're gonna give you our customized skin fusion. I developed this with a colleague of mine in DC. It's a vitamin A infusion. We customize it to each client's needs by using active powdered blends. So these are the most um, effective versions of the vitamins that we can infuse directly into your skin. There's right. no downtime, no pain, no actual needles. We use a nano needle cartridge to separate the cells of the epidermis and push the product in. You get a beautiful glow for several weeks following the treatment with no downtime. Wow, that uh, that sounds impressive. When you say, what would you say with the epidermis? What did you just? What would you just? We separate the cells of the epidermis with a nano needle. Separate cartridge. the cells. That that sounds very cool. I'm excited, and it sounds like a great way to start the new year Absolutely. with a beautiful glow. Get that glow on. All right. We're gonna get our glow on, and in the meantime, you watch this. As virtual reality softwares become more sophisticated, we're now able to interact with the environment and art through more and more of our senses. Our brain and body begin to experience the virtual reality as less virtual and more reality. Hi, I'm Aniva Zaman for SoFlow Health. Virtual reality isn't just for gamers anymore. Oh no, it can actually do a lot more than you can imagine. Let's go check out and see how this headset can actually benefit your mind, body, and health. So the virtual reality therapy is a journey where you are exploring a painting that I've created and you're experiencing light in many different forms. So energetically, I'm able to incorporate Reiki and guided meditation to help you see more, feel more, experience more, open your heart, open your mind. It's just this experience of discovery and curiosity and those are all things that help keep us alive, that keep us vibrant, that keep us inspired to, to to live, to grow, to evolve. So it helps you open your mind, the way you think, and kind of ground you, in other words. It, you know, it's interesting, because it, in a way it helps ground you, but you're flying. <laughs> I actually noticed that you've incorporated sound and aroma within your therapy. Can you tell us about how it benefits someone's well-being? So you're already fully immersed in the virtual reality. I thought it would be a really beautiful thing to bring in now the senses and have you focus on the other senses as well. So each aromatherapy is designated for the chakra. I also incorporate some teas, so that also helps your sense of I taste. I did notice that. And that helps balance, it helps relax, it helps elevate. I also incorporate the Reiki, so that's a sense of touch. The sound, as we saw with the sound healing and the didgeridoo, the artwork will also resonate to the music. So now you're incorporating the sound frequency, so it's a sound healing in addition to the other senses. Why do you use art instead of nature? That's an interesting question, and it also connects to the bridging of the technology and the nature and the art. Some people are so removed from nature that getting in, in the headset where they're looking at a tree is actually closer to nature than they could get right. without it. It's not in nature, but you see the tree, you feel the tree. I invite people to hug the tree in my painting. Right. How does VR therapy influence different chakras or how does that play a role in VR therapy? People feel a general overall sense of alignment. I give you audio cues, not only visual cues. So I'm stimulating the senses of the mind, the body and spirit to help you connect to different vibrational frequencies and cues that help balance each of the chakras. It's the entire experience. We're all so stimulated by the outside world 
And with the virtual reality, it is a stimulation of the outside world, although my paintings are directed to take you on an internal journey. It invites you to look within, to see the light within, to feel your chakras, whether you know what they are or not. You know, it's all about light and vibration and movement of energy. So just having that awareness, I would say, is a health benefit in itself. Now I can actually find my happy place without even leaving the room. Wonderful, now take a deep breath in. Stay right there when SoFlo Health returns. My face will be clean and ready for the vitamin A skin infusion. The skin fusion even. Focusing on you, innovations in modern medicine from your team of experts at UHealth, the University of Miami Health System. For anyone who is paralyzed, the dream is to be able to move freely again. Here at UHealth, neurosurgeons and biomedical engineers are using new robotic technology to help make that a reality. At the Miami Project to Cure Paralysis, part of UHealth, a unique research study has helped a Miami man regain movement. Study participant Herman Aldana was paralyzed in a car accident when he was just 16 years old. After my accident, I was sad, angry, a lot of emotion. I heard about the Miami Project and I was interested in this study to try to help cure paralysis. As part of the study, devices were implanted in Herman's chest and brain. When he thinks about moving his hands, it sends signals to a computer that communicates wirelessly to an orthotic glove. The wireless capabilities of this, I think, allow us to potentially move this to a home setting. Me being able to grab stuff, do all the movement I, I'm able to do now, something I dreamed about. The results have been absolutely striking. And our hopes are that in the not too distant future, he can start to do these things outside of the lab. We will show that he can initiate steps. The goal is to walk again. Welcome back to SoFlow Health. I'm Hunter Frankie, and that's Kayla McGrew, and I'm at Skin, and what are we doing next? We are going to do a little polish on your skin with an alpha hydroxy acid. We're basically removing some of the stratum corneum. The stratum corneum is the dead layer of cells that sits on the surface of your skin. It protects you from the elements. It's part of your body's natural protection system, but when we are doing skin treatments, we want to buff some of that stuff off so we can really get down to the meat of it and give you all the benefits of the products. Well, this feels great. Just a little bit of a tingle right now, and it smells even better. You know, this is going to help your skin look great, and you know what else does? Eating a healthy diet. Check it out. It's that time of year again. What do I eat to stay healthy? Is it the paleo diet, the keto diet, the South Beach diet because we live here, or maybe the Mediterranean diet, which you might have heard of? And the reason you heard of it is, Mediterranean diets became popular among the health food community because of the ingredients that go in most Mediterranean foods. There's a lot of seafood, olive oil, herbs, fruits and vegetables, and whole grains. What more could you want out of a good diet? That's why we're here today at Meraki Greek Bistro in Coconut Grove, where it doesn't just look like a little piece of grease, it tastes like it too. This is Chef Giannis. He is the mastermind behind all of this. Chef, what do we have in front of us here today? This is a, the, the shrimp pasta, this is a filet mignon kebab, and this is a Greek salad. All these of them is original Greek food. So it's not about just finding the equivalent here in America, it's really bringing the flavors from Greece. Of course, here. of course, of course. And that makes all the difference in traditional Of Greek course, food. of course. And uh, so uh, what goes into the salad, what's in here? Tomatoes, mm -hmm. cucumbers, onion, green peppers, capers, olives, Friend, oregano, olive oil, and right. very little bit vinegar. Now, what about in uh, on our kebab here? What do you have? You said filet mignon, which is this impressive. Is a filet, this is a filet mignon. This uh, has the, the salt and pepper and oregano, the spice from Greece. I make marine one day before. Right. Today, it's cooked. So you're importing ingredients from Greece, not just bringing the flavors from there, but you're importing olive oil and other herbs that you're using, yes. correct? Olive oil, olives, oregano, salt, Right. Capers, all this from Greece. Everything's different. It's just different. Oh, of course. <laughs> and people that have been there can tell you that. <laughs> Here we go. Wow. Every, as you continue to chew, you just get more and more flavor. Thank you. Thank this you so incredible. much. Chef, this is absolutely delicious. Thank you so much. I'm going to continue to eat this. I'm sure you got to get back in the kitchen, right? Yes. I need to, do, to continue to cook. Thank you for coming. 
Thank you so and, much for uh, having us. I wish to see you again. Oh, you will. <laughs> Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes. Bye. Now I'm going to give this a try. This is delicious. Holy cow. This is incredible. And what's great about this is that everything in front of us is traditional Greek food and it goes to show you that a lot of traditional Greek food can be good for you, full of flavor, and healthy food doesn't have to be boring. Everything you see in front of you is real whole foods that is basically homemade. Say you're a red meat lover and you want to enjoy yourself while sticking to your diet. Well, here you're getting a lean cut of meat, you're having fries that are made fresh. Now, I wish I had somebody else here to help me finish all this, but I think I'll manage. Well, my face is all cleaned off now, correct? Buffed and polished. Buffed and polished. And uh, you're making the mixture over there. I am. So this is your like pure vitamin A. Mm -hmm. Vitamin A boosts your cellular turnover, gives you a beautiful glow. Um, we're gonna use this as the base for your entire infusion. This is the same in everyone's treatment. What's mm -hmm. gonna be specific is I'm gonna choose active powdered ingredients that are the, what your skin is telling me it needs. Okay, cool. This is a blend of different powdered actives for anti-aging. And then we're gonna mix in some skin nutrition. So this is a, a blend of a bunch of different vitamins that your skin is always in need of. While he's mixing up the mixture, uh, you can watch this. Yeah, yeah, no worries. I'll get it done. Okay, have a good one. Bye. So you're at work and you just got hit with yet another task to complete before the day is over. It seems to be that there's no time left in the day. Let alone are you gonna make it to the gym by the end of the day. Well, the new year's here, so let's manage our time a little bit better. Let's go. When it comes to time management, I find the most important thing for me is writing things down. So let me show you a few ways that you can improve your time management, and let's write it down. First thing, we are going to make a list. Next, limit distractions. Regardless of how motivated I feel, if I see something ding up in the corner and the phone light up, I'm definitely inclined to pick up that phone. Next thing you know, you've wasted 45 minutes over the course of a few hours just checking your phone a few times. Learn to say no. Learn to say no, guys. You're only gonna let yourself down. You're gonna end up taking on way too much and you're gonna be overwhelmed and actually not be able to complete the things that you need to complete. Don't be afraid to ask for help. If you're anything like me, you try to get everything done on your own. You're go, go, go. Well, sometimes it's more beneficial and more productive to your time if maybe you delegate a few tasks and you let people help you. And it's funny because when minds come together, sometimes you can end up getting a lot more done. So these little habits, if you implement every day, could really go a long way and make yourself way more productive with your time. Speaking of time, I'm getting a little hungry. I think it's time to eat. Meet me in the kitchen. When it comes to your New Year's goals, staying on point with your nutrition is key. For me, an easy way I do that is meal prepping Monday to Friday. As simple as can be. Right here I made some sweet potato, some zucchini, Brussels sprouts, and some chicken. Very simple, everything in the oven. I only used three pans to do this. I find that when I prep my food for the week ahead, I'm way more likely to stay on track and stay consistent, and I'm way less likely to grab something unhealthy because there's no room for error and there's no reason I should be making any excuses. As we know, in order to eat all of this food, we have to be putting in the work. So you stay tuned, and later on I'm gonna show you how you can reach all your New Year's fitness goals in the gym. There's more of Morgan's tips and tricks to stay on course to health and some great information from Dr. McCauley about tooth implants coming up. Welcome back to SoFlo Health. It's time, the moment has arrived. What is happening now? So I'm brushing the actual infusion onto your skin. Um, it's a pure vitamin A that we customized with different ingredients for your skin, hyaluronic acid, vitamins, anti-aging products. We're gonna have you looking 13 when it's over. Great. And now I'm gonna go ahead and use the uh, device with the nano needle cartridge. Um, we typically cover these when it's a tattoo or a microneedling procedure. Yeah. But in this case, since no, skin's, no skin is being broken, there's no blood present, it's not necessary. Wow, that's very interesting. Doesn't hurt at all. It's just kind of a vibrating sensation on my forehead. This process takes about how long? Uh, about 10, 15 minutes. All right, well, unfortunately, it's not gonna take that long for you. So in the meantime, check this out. We're back with Macaulay Periodontics. The last time we were here, we talked about gum disease, and today we're gonna talk about implants. Isn't that correct? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, so today we're gonna to talk about dental implants. Okay. So this is probably the best way to replace your teeth. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people are asking right now, what is a dental implant? It's actually a titanium screw okay. that goes into your bone right there. It replaces these roots right here. So okay. instead of roots, when you lose a tooth, you obviously don't have anything here. We were able to place an implant, replace that tooth, and get it so you can chew. Basically, it looks nice and it's good for function as well. Looking up here, we actually have somebody who lost most of their teeth. I think wow. they had maybe four teeth remaining right there, and we were able to actually replace all of their teeth. This patient, because it was a full arch case, right. he was able to get his get his teeth a temporary set the next day. And that's something that's the nice to be able day. to do. He went from this <laughs> to having teeth right. the following day. And this is an improvement to the quality of life of the patient because they're able to chew better, they're able to have a tooth where there wasn't one, it's yeah. for the aesthetic purpose. Oh yeah, no, this is this is a complete quality of life change right. because again, you've got people walking around like this guy. He was missing most of his teeth. He was just had four teeth right there right. and they didn't look very good. So it's, it's something where you can go from basically not being able to eat anything but applesauce right. to being able to eat a full apple, bite into it and everything. And what sets you apart from other places that are, are doing implants? Well, the thing is, we are a specialty practice. I went to Nova Southeastern University. Mm -hmm. I got trained there in a three-year residency. Mm -hmm. Whereas a lot of guys, they end up taking a weekend course and really? they come in and they think, you know, they can place implants. Maybe you can, but is it a great idea? Sometimes not. So what is the goal of getting an implant? Well, the goal is to replace your teeth. For someone who's losing their teeth or they've already lost them, right. it's to get the, the most natural and the best function you can get out of your teeth. Right. So you can eat and you can be happy and healthy with them. So here's kind of an example. So here's a patient that oh actually my. ended up walking in like this. You can see wow. the teeth, they're dangling in the air right there. Those aren't gonna last much longer. So <laughs> what we were able to do is we were actually able to replace these teeth wow with these and these are actually only the temporaries and this is only a couple days later we took that photo Th these are a couple days apart mm -hmm. these are that a couple days apart is incredible mm -hmm. <laughs> so you can see you can go from not being able to eat anything yeah. to being able to eat naturally in right. only a couple days well doctor thank you so much for your time hopefully no one is at this point yeah uh, but if they're anywhere in between that you can get them right back here mm -hmm. that's what we're here for <laughs> <laughs> thank you what do I look like right now? This is crazy. <laughs> All right. But it feels great. Yeah. What do we have here? This is just a hot towel we're gonna use to really percolate down into the skin, and then as it cools, I'm gonna remove the product with it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so now I'm gonna do the massage with an ultra hydrating balm. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna sit back here, and like I have in this whole time, <laughs> and enjoy this massage while you check in with Morgan. So far, we've covered time management, nutrition, and now we're at one of my favorite places, the gym. I find that after the holidays, people are so overwhelmed by the weight they gained, the fact that they fell off their schedule, that they often go to extremes to reach their fitness goals. Well, this isn't healthy either. You don't wanna go all out. You're gonna end up overtraining, burnt out, and you are not likely to stick to your goals. So stay consistent stay realistic, and get up and get after it. Another thing that I think is so important when it comes to sticking to your fitness goals for the new year is switching it up. Maybe you're used to doing lunges with the dumbbells, so why not try a simple dumbbell carry? You could even switch it up even more and do a crossbody carry. Point is, switch it up, change your exercise selection, try out a new gym class, try out a new sport, Try training with a friend, anything that's going to keep you motivated for the long term and stick to these goals, not just a temporary resolution. And last but not least, I think it's so important that you share your goals with someone. Not only will this hold you accountable, but you can do this on social media. Make it known, tell a friend, post it, even tag us at SoFlo Health. Point is, once you make it known, you're more inclined to hold yourself accountable and stick to it. Moral of the story, set realistic goals. View it as a lifestyle transformation, not a temporary goal you're trying to reach. Change your routine. Start training with a friend. Hold yourself accountable. Switch it up. Whatever you do, do not give up. But I got one more thing for you. Come with me. And here we are, at home relaxing with a good book. We went over time management, 
nutrition, and we crush it in the gym, doing all things that make you feel good for the new year. And make sure you don't forget to relax. For me, that's putting on some comfy clothes and reading a good book. For you, that can look completely different, and that's fine. Maybe you want to watch TV, spend some time with your friends and family. Just take some time to chill out and appreciate all the hard work you did do at work, in the kitchen, in the gym. I hope all of this helped, and I hope you all spent some time to relax and kickstart your new year off the right way. Don't miss the Broward Veterans Expo happening on Saturday, January 18th at the Omni Auditorium in Broward College's North Campus. If you're a veteran, come on down and get free help filing for new disability claims, increases in existing claims, and many more free services from the Department of Veteran Affairs, Career Source Broward, and more, all at no cost to veterans. For more information, call Cynthia at 305-926-0432 or Michael at 860 860- 9838086 Welcome back to SoFlow Health and ta-da, here it is. What done. did we do today? So we basically used a nanoneedling device to push vitamin A and some customized actives into your skin. Um, we treated your exact conditions. You mentioned that you had some concerns about hydration. We use um, a lot of vitamins in your skin yeah. and hydrating products. We're also going to recommend some things that you could use at home to prolong the benefits of this. Right. Um, you are mildly flushed right now. That's mm-hmm. really just because of your fair complexion. In most cases, we don't see that at all. In your case, um, it's going to dissipate within the next hour or so. There is zero downtime from this. Now, seeing the final result, it looks great and it feels great. I think most importantly, it helps you feel good. And if you feel good in your own skin, um, that's just good for you. Absolutely. All right, Caleb, thank you so much for everything today. And uh, I appreciate it. My pleasure. Mm -hmm. I feel great and I look great. Thank you so much for watching this episode of SoFlow Health. And thank you to Skin and Caleb for having us here today and taking good care of my face. As always, you can watch previous episodes of SoFlow Health on SoFlowHealth.com. You can follow us using at SoFlow Health to share with us what you're doing to stay healthy. Next week, Mr. You Can Too has us tapping into some primal movements. Find out why Andrew Otazo is dragging this cart and me through a storm, and we discover new yoga moves that are more comfortable than they look.